Is it time to buy or sell SPY ETF? In this video, we're diving deep into SPY. Our initial report was published on our website on Tuesday, September 12, 2023, and now we're here to provide you with an even more detailed analysis. Remember to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell to stay updated on our latest analysis. You don't want to miss any crucial updates that could impact your investments. Enhance your trading decisions by trying our newly launched AI stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. Tap into the power of AI and get a free price predictions and deep analysis for anyone among 25,000 companies worldwide today. Please note that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered as financial advice. Since September 11, 2023, our system has ranked SPY as a hold slash accumulate, giving it a score of minus 0.92. Let's take a look at the stock's performance during this period. The stock has had natural fluctuations, but currently sits at a loss of minus 0.55% since our initial hold slash accumulate recommendation. This translates to an average loss of minus 0.27% per day since it was listed as hold slash accumulate. The ETF is moving within a horizontal trend and further movements within this trend can be expected. The current three-month trend suggests a potential 1.64% change over the next three months, with a possible return between minus 0.103% and 5.15%. As for the 12-month trend, it suggests a 21.07% change over the next 12 months, with a potential return between 15.74% and 26.92%. This translates to a price range of $516.20 to $566.06 after a year. Our latest daily update for SPY includes the headline, Weaker Technical Forecast for SPY as ETF Downgraded to Hold Slash Accumulate. The SPY ETF price fell by minus 0.549% on the last day, Tuesday, September 12, 2023, from $448.45 to $445.99. During the last trading day the ETF fluctuated 0.705% from a day low at $445.39 to a day high of $448.53. The price has been going up and down for this period, and there has been a 0.73% gain for the last two weeks. Volume has increased on the last day by 7 million shares but on falling prices. This may be an early warning and the risk will be increased slightly over the next couple of days. In total, 67 million shares were bought and sold for approximately $30.03 billion. Over the past 52 weeks, the highest price of ETF was $459.44, and the lowest price was $348.11. Currently, the price is 2.93%, or $13.45, below the 52-week high, and 7.08%, or $33.99, below the all-time high on January 4, 2022, when the price reached $479.98. The following signals have been identified for SPY. Furthermore, there is a buy signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence, MACD. Some negative signals were issued as well, and these may have some influence on the near short term development. The SPY ETF holds sell signals from both short and long term moving averages, giving a more negative forecast for the stock. On corrections up, there will be some resistance from the lines at $447.34 and $446.92. A breakup above any of these levels will issue by signals. A sell signal was issued from a pivot top point on Friday, September 1, 2023 and so far it has fallen minus 1.15%. Further fall is indicated until a new bottom pivot has been found. Volume rose on falling prices yesterday. This may be an early warning and the ETF should be followed more closely. The ETF had a golden star signal on Monday, March 27, 2023 in the long-term chart. Golden star signal is when the short-term moving average, the long-term moving average, and price line meet in a special combination. This combination is very rare and often followed by long and strong gains for the ETF in question. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence, buy signal. Pivots, sell signal 7 days ago. Bollinger, 
by signal 17 days ago. Short-term moving average, by signal 3 days ago. Long-term moving average, by signal 3 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages. By signal 6 days ago. If we look at the 12-month chart we see. Short moving average, by signal 11 days ago. The long-term moving average, by signal 119 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages. By signal 110 days ago. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support, Risk, and Stop Loss for SPY SPY finds support from accumulated volume at $442.55 and this level may hold a buying opportunity as an upwards reaction can be expected when the support is being tested. In general the ETF tends to have very controlled movements and with good liquidity the risk is considered very low in this stock. During the last day, the ETF moved $3.14 between high and low, or 0.705%. For the last week the ETF has had daily average volatility of 0.698%. Now let's discuss some potential day trading levels for SPY. In case of an upward trend, the first resistance level for SPY is at $446.81. If you don't own any shares, you may want to wait for this level to be breached before entering a position. For those already holding the stock, this could be a level to consider for swing trading. On the downside, SPY encounters its first support level at $442.55. If this support level holds, it could be a good entry point, anticipating a rebound. Our recommended stop loss is set at $432.06, minus 3.12%. This ETF has low daily movements and this gives low risk. There is a sell signal from a pivot top found six days ago. Is SPY ETF a good buy? SPY holds several negative signals and this should be a sell candidate, but due to the general chance for a turnaround situation it should be considered as a hold candidate, hold or accumulate, in this position whilst awaiting further development. Due to some small weaknesses in the technical picture we have downgraded our analysis conclusion for this ETF since the last evaluation from a buy to a hold slash accumulate candidate. After analyzing the volatility and movements for the last trading day, our systems find that the current price is undervalued. For trading on Wednesday, September 13th, we expect SPY to open up $0.647 and start trading at $446.64. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money, and that you should speak with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. You should not base your investment decision upon stockinvest.us. By using the information, you agree and are held liable for your own investment decisions. This is our current view of the stock. Do you agree or disagree? Comment below and share your thoughts. What is your target for the ETF? Remember to like and subscribe. We wish you successful trading and have a beautiful day with regards from all of us here at Stock Invest.